12 to 15. That's all you need, baby. Well, Kenneth, no, it's not. We need more than that. Why? Because of inflation. You are asking us to take 10 to 15 hundred dollars. And and the real truth, Joe, first person need the cash, yeah? The real truth is, in my city, where am I going to live for that? Y'all are up in the rent. The rent's high as, got, is, is high as hell. And you think that 12 is going to cut it. It's not, bro. The 12 is not going to cut it. Yeah, we didn't even discuss before taxes, actually. We didn't, we didn't even get into that. The 12 is not going to cut it, man. The average car note is $7,800. So if I want to live in the place I want to live, I'm paying $1,600. And then my car note $700. It's not enough money, player. It's not enough money. The real problem, I think it is, is that the informed consumer, the informed driver, the informed uh, employee, they know how much stuff costs. They're not taking your $1,200. They know that's not enough money. No, it's not enough money. They know they need to be around two grand a week and preferably taking home two grand a week. Someone right now tell me how much two grand a week take home is yearly. I will wait. <clears throat> How much two grand a week take home? How much is that weekly? I mean, yearly. 52 weeks of two grand. What is that? 52 times two. That's $104,000 a year. Then depending on your state, you can go ahead and slice 20% off that, Blake boy. That's gone. 20% off the tiz app. Mario, that's 20% off the top. What are you left with? Let's do some math for these people. Let's do some math. 20% off 104 is what? I will wait. 20% off 104 is what? Mario says 28 grand off the top, Playboy. As you read, that leaves you with what? What does that leave you with? That leaves you with 83,200, according to DJ Free. Now you're down to 82,000. All right. So we, we call it the flat 80, right? Someone says 83,2. So now you're down to 80,000. Everybody got the Denali. It's everywhere. Denali average note is a thousand a month. So we'll take 12 off of that. 12 gone. 12,000 off of 83,000 is what? It's what? You down to seventy one thousand dollars? Got to have insurance. People got kids, man. Insurance is is average. What at one of these companies? How much is insurance for two point five kids? How much is insurance for that? You got your wife. You got your two kids, two or three kids. How much they gonna hit y'all for insurance for that a week? Under thirty percent. Angelique says three fifty a week. Hold the phone. Three fifty a week. That's another. Jeez, Louise, that's a thousand. We call that a thou hour a month. That's gonna be a thou hour a month, bro. Twelve hundred a month. You multiply that by twelve. You at thirteen thousand off of seventy one. What are you after thirteen thousand off of seventy one?
What are you after 13,000 off of 71? Now wait. I'm going to explain these numbers to these people. Thirteen thousand off of seventy one thousand is what? Three fifty a week is not unheard of for, for a bunch of kids. You're down to fifty eight thousand. You're down to 58,000, according to Mario. 57, according to Swoken. 68, according to Angelique. We're going to say we're down to 57,000. You know what I haven't factored in yet? Tell me what I haven't factored in yet. Because I took care of insurance for the kids. I took care of the car to carry all the kids. I, took, I, took, I, I haven't put in car insurance. I haven't even put in mortgage or rent. So we're assuming you want your kids to go to a nice area. Haven't touched gas, haven't touched food, haven't touched utilities. Peace of the God, the rebirth and the re-education only for the nation. How much is the average house cost in America and how much is the mortgage? Because you want your kid to go to a nice place. I mean, you, you make 130. You make 120 a year, you want your kid to go to a nice school. But how much does a house cost in the best school system in your area with low crime? Give me a number. How much is that house? <laughs> Angelique, I don't know where the hell you live. 250000 girl, you, you better stop. You better stop, Shawty. Eric says 330. 170 for me. Eric says 1700 a month in most areas. Now, let's say your rent is that low, but since everything's going crazy in the country right now, taxes and furthermore, insurance is higher. The loans are funkier. The interest rates are higher. So right now, what is the average person paying for mortgage a month? The average mortgage in America is seventeen hundred. Payment is twenty eight hundred dollars a month. We are down to fifty seven thousand, and your mortgage is around twenty eight hundred a month. We'll call it 25, because that's the average for the whole country. We'll call it 25. What is 25 times 12? What does that add up to? Let's add it up. Come on. What is it? 25 times 12 is what? $30,000, you are down to $27,000 left and you haven't paid for food. You haven't paid for school clothes. You haven't paid for lights, internet, cell phone. Nothing. We haven't discussed car insurance. We haven't discussed car insurance. So no, Ken, they're not signing up for $1,200. We're not signing up for $1,200 because we did that based on $2,000 a week. And we just took all this man's money. He ain't been to the club. He ain't bought Fendi, nothing. Just him being an adult. That shit's gone. That's gone. It's gone. 
That's not you you're not you're not offering if you're offering twelve to fifteen hundred dollars a week, you're offering him to be wor- working in poverty. Or choosing to live in a shitty area. No one likes this conversation. Look, no one hit the cage yet. Only Joe. Get into it, Joe says. So no. No. Twelve hundred a, no- a week ain't enough. Fifteen hundred a week ain't enough. And it's a damn show ain't enough. Before taxes. It definitely ain't enough before taxes. So when they say, oh, it's a driver shortage. They're all gone. We don't know where they've been. No, my brother, there's a pay shortage compared to inflation. Things cost more money. That $1,200 a week shit ain't going to work no more. It's not. We are tired of going to be gone for 70 hours, which let's be real, 80 hours is two jobs. So I'm giving you 70, which is really like 90, if we know the industry. I'm giving you two jobs worth of working. Travis Numb, the second they hit the gas yet. I'm giving you two jobs worth of working, and I'm ending up with 1,500 before taxes. Two jobs. That means I could go work two jobs. There's, and then we, you don't think we can't compare it? My brother down the, down the county, he worked 40 hours a week. Yeah, but he don't make 68. He only make 50. But he only working one job. I'm working the equivalent of two jobs. And I'm gone. He's home every day, four o'clock. Forget about it. He's home, he's home on the weekend. He go to cookouts. I can't do none of that. I make a little more than him, but the lifestyles don't match. The lifestyles don't match. They don't. So no, I'm not happy. If you want me to live this different lifestyle, nah, doggy. You have to pay me like 25 a week, playboy. That's the fact. I don't know what to tell you. I'm going to need 25. I'm not going to be happy to work for 1200 a week when I am basically working in poverty and I'm sacrificing a bunch. The point of coming to this job was to get ahead. I'm not getting ahead with anything less than two grand a week. That's a fact, though. That is why Gemini and Loves ain't worrying about this. Because they paying like that. That is why the oil people ain't worrying about this. That is why, no, no, it's, he, he said, uh, uh, he said, I'm driving. He ain't paying no better no money. Get out of here, bro. Everybody is looking to see where the money at, and they're going to oversized hazmat and specialty. They're not doing that general freight shit. That general money ain't popping like that. It ain't going to work. Because now I'm broke the numbers down. Right. E-man, I'll take like 18 on it. It got to be somewhere in that region, bro. 15 ain't going to do it. And damn sure 12 ain't going to do it. Damn sure $1,200 ain't going to do it. Sorry, it ain't going to work. It's not going to work. Sorry. It's not. Unless now I got to live in some alternative ass lifestyle. I can't live in the city. I want my kids can't. I can't live in the city. I can't live next to the good school system for my children. So no, I'm not taking that deal. Let it burn. That's how the people, that's how people are taking it. I'm not taking that deal, bro. I don't want it. Today, what we are dealing with is an informed consumer and or employee who can go online and figure out how much money they need to be making and come to you not blind. That is what they don't like.
You cannot sell me on a $60,000 existence. It's not going to work. Because the other people keep upping the rent. So if they up the rent, your pay has to match it. You're not matching the pay, bro. The inflation's moving up more than we're getting paid. So people are not taking the job. So it makes you feel like, oh, it's a shortage. No, 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 no. The deal you're offering isn't enough money. Because I guarantee you, if you came up there and said, oh, you can make $2,300 a week home every weekend, you would fill up. But, you know, you can't do that or you're not going to. I don't know your personal numbers. You're not going to. The truth is, you didn't follow inflation. If you've been in business since 1989, life has inflated since then. Why you ain't went up? Hmm? Why you ain't went up? As he said, for inflation, we should be making 138. We not making close. If you're paying me 1200, no, you're me. I'm way underpaid. I'm way underpaid. And after a while, that erodes a person's morale, and then they stop doing it, or they go to where the money is. And the truth is, all the they're going to where the money's at, and that's going to be in your hazmaty stuff, oversized crane work. You know, the bed buggers, car haulers, they're worried about getting theirs. They're not worried about that regular friend. They're not worried about that. That's the truth. They're not worried about that. Nope. Gotta do better than that, Playboy. You know, and and the uh the um their taste has went up. Because the internet has shown people too much shit. They've shown people in big houses. They've shown people in nice cars. They want those cars now. They want the Denali's and stuff. They want the Escalades. They want the forerunner trucks that are 70, 80 grand. They want the Land Cruisers, Mercedes, and the Benzes and all that. People ain't just trying. going to be okay driving an old uh, station wagon back and forth to work. It's not going to work. Socially, it does not work. It doesn't work socially because even in, in this day's time, if a man goes, you basically saying you can make 1200 a week. Do you, and I don't know if these people know that in these companies don't know if they care a man making 50, a man making $1,500 a week, we'll call him 58,000 a year. A man making 58,000 a year is completely undateable or marriable in this climate. And men are not going to work jobs that don't get them no butt. Y'all understand that, don't you? That's what the erosion to all this relationship podcast bullshit does. The men look at it. They figure out what the women want, and they look at what this, this don't pay enough money. I don't want to be that. I don't want the people to talk to talk about what I do like that. So they don't do it. So you telling me you're going to pay your people $1,200 a week, right? And uh, I'm not going to be here long. I'm not going to be here long. I'm going to get my point out and I'm going to get on off. Um, you're going to pay these people $50-something a year, and they're going to turn around and be in sales? Right now, men. What reaction would you get from one of these chicks? Oh, the young men, speak young men, speak up. What reaction you gonna get to a chick you tell her you make fifty thousand a year? Hello, Trucker Brown here. I'm so happy that you are here on Rumble TV Uncut. We are up to three hundred and fifty followers. I appreciate 
every person that decided to come over and follow. Why go to Rumble? Well, in Rumble, you will get 100% of your not notification. You won't get this, oh, I didn't get your notification, TB. I didn't know you were live, TB. Over there, you get 100% of it. You actually get two notifications over there. Also, over there, we can say what we want. We can speak freely because the Rumble platform really pushes freedom of speech. Don't do drugs. Be happy. Follow me, Trucker Brown, over there on Rumble.